Introduction to Centimeter Part 3 Today we will learn how to use a scale correctly to measure objects and how to measure objects correctly using a broken scale. I think your pencil is shorter than my pencil. It looks equal to me. Let us measure and see. I will measure my pencil and you measure yours. My pencil is 10 centimeters long. Now you measure your pencil. My pencil is 12 centimeters long. I told you, my pencil is longer than your pencil. It should not be because both our pencils are new. Show me. See. Hmm. Now I know why this is happening. What did you understand? Look, you have placed the bottom end of your pencil at 2 cm, while I have placed the bottom end of my pencil at 0 cm. What difference does that make? It leads to incorrect measurements. To measure the correct length of objects using a scale, we should place their lower end at 0, like I have done. Oh, I understand now. The problem with keeping the pencil at 2 cm is that there is no pencil from 0 cm to 2 cm. And I included that length as well in the measurement. Now I'll correct it. I'll keep the pencil at 0 cm. Yes, it's correct. Now you will be able to tell the exact length of the pencil. My pencil is also 10 cm. Let's measure some more objects. Oh, your scale is broken. How will I measure the length of objects now? I think we can measure the length of objects with this broken scale too. How? Let us try and measure the pencil with this broken scale. We start counting from the least centimeter mark. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 and 11. Why is the pencil measuring 11 centimeters? We just measured it. It was 10 centimeters then. It means we have made some mistake. Let's do one thing. Let's try to measure this pencil with the correct scale. Then we might come to know our mistake. I will start counting again. One. Wait. What happened? Look. The correct scale has a zero written at the starting point. While measuring with the broken scale, we are starting from one. This means whenever we measure using a broken scale, we will still start from zero. Yes. Let's measure now. Zero. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. 10 centimeters. Now the measurement is correct. We need to remember these two rules while measuring any object. The 0 centimeter point of the scale will be placed at the beginning of the object and to measure an object, we will start from 0 marking on the scale.